Uh, first of all, uh, welcome to Cato Networks. We're really glad to have you uh, all in here uh, in our offices. Um, I'm uh, Elad, I'm uh, from uh, Cato Networks. Um, I'll share a few uh, details about myself in the next uh, slide. Also, I want to thank, uh, before we start, I want to thank uh, the PyData community uh, to let us, uh, for letting us host this event uh, in here, um, and to the organizing, or, uh, organizers of uh, this uh, meetup, um, Uri uh, Nofau, which is not here, um, uh, from PyData, and uh, uh, Sharon uh, and the team in Cato for uh, organizing this. So uh, thank you very much. And uh, OK, so uh, let's start. We have a really cool uh, agenda. Uh, I'll just uh, share a few uh, words about myself. I've been with Cato for uh, uh, a little bit more than uh, six years, um, mostly you know, like uh, uh, running uh, research stuff in viral, uh, different uh, organization, focused in the security industry. In the cybersecurity industry, um, I don't have a lot of uh, uh, things uh, to say, um, but uh, I, I would say that I have uh, I dealt with a lot of and handled lots of stuff within the cybersecurity from the low level uh, security like malware research and reverse engineering until like you know, like till uh, higher level uh, um, uh, projects uh, with different complexity and. Uh, with the uh, um, with the experience of working in SaaS companies, I realized how important it is to um, utilize uh, vast amounts of data, and that's uh, also what I did in the uh, two companies I worked for, um, both in uh, Trustier and here in Cato Networks. And we're going to uh, share a little bit of what we're doing here in uh, in Cato Networks. So uh, I'll just uh, uh, start. Um, what's Cato Networks? So basically, uh, Cato uh, provides a, a, a cloud platform okay, that allows uh, our organizations to uh, utilize or to, that provides all the, net, the, the networking and network security access connectivity services uh, to organizations. So these organizations today usually are using on-premise uh, uh, appliances or boxes, uh, for example, uh, firewalls, uh, uh, remote access, VPNs, uh, um, uh, SD1, um, MPLS links. So, um, so Cato provides a platform that allows to replace all these boxes and, and move them to the cloud. Okay, it's part of. Uh, a bigger, uh, uh, I, I would call it a bigger process, uh, which is called a cloudification. Okay, so we basically uh, uh, do cloudification for all the legacy and all boxes uh, that used to be, uh, and, and it's really hard for organization to maintain all the IT and uh, networking and network security infrastructure. So we, move, we, we actually move all these uh, uh, boxes to the cloud. Okay, so this is one element which is uh, really interesting in terms of uh, uh, when we move to the big data world. So now we have access to much more and we have visibility to much more uh, data and we can run and conduct research on data that in the, in the past was only uh, uh, you know, accessed by the uh, organization themselves and they didn't know, like, they didn't have um, the ability to access it or uh, research on top of it. And now we, as a, as a SaaS vendor, uh, are able to access this uh, uh, type of uh, uh, data source uh, with a lot of uh, network traffic and then network security, like that, it is, that is coming from network appliances and uh, security appliances. Um, the other uh, element is uh, convergence. Is, um, we, we basically replace different point solutions, okay? That each point solutions is responsible for some uh, uh, 
um, capability. As I said, as I mentioned earlier, uh, uh, network connectivity, network access, uh, network security. So it, it can be the firewall, it can be the uh, intrusion and prevention uh, system, uh, anti-malware, uh, SD1, etc. So basically, we converge all these uh, 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 point solutions uh, from many, many vendors and solutions into a single platform that uh, provides all these cap capabilities. And I think that the combination of uh, both uh, cloudification and uh, uh, convergence, those are really important elements in uh, uh, companies that want to conduct research on uh, uh, big data. Um, and, and this is a key element uh, uh, for us uh, to improve our service to uh, uh, our customers. Um, and if you think about, the, let's say, cloudification, it's like what uh, uh, Netflix uh, uh, did when uh, you know, we had like Blockbuster in the past with all the DVDs. So, and, and now uh, they moved all these boxes to the, the cloud. So basically, that's what uh, uh, Kato does uh, uh, to uh, uh, this uh, networking and network security world. So, um, so as a uh, big, uh, so, so now I describe why uh, I think that Cato is a big data uh, <laughs> platform or company. Uh, and I want to say a few words about uh, our journey. So uh, when I joined uh, uh, Cato um, more than six uh, years ago, we had our, uh, we just you know launched uh, the product and. Uh, uh, we started with uh, one customer. You know, we started uh, looking at the traffic, different logs that are coming from our platform, and uh, we we um, basically we, we built the the product uh, in a way like we had the talent that also already worked in other uh, SaaS company, and we knew that we 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 have to build a product in a way that will allow us to conduct research on top of that. We knew that we we're going to have a lot of customers. We knew that we're, we're going to see a lot of traffic. And, and, and we, we knew that we need to uh, build the infrastructure in order to uh, research on, on it. So, um, so I would say that it, it's kind of a triangle. Like we have the data that is growing and growing. And we also have the uh, data engineering uh, area, which is also, oh, it's all, it's always changing. Like already, like it, it you, we need to adapt it to, you know, and refactor it all the time to to make sure we handle the the, the right capacity and also the the, the expertise that we need. Uh, and also in terms of the the data, the data science and the analysis aspect, it's also something that uh, need to uh, grow. Um, uh, over time, and uh, uh, in Cato, like we started, you know, just you, you just start a startup company, and uh, you get data from uh, your first customers, and how you how, how how do we start? So you start with like uh, I don't know, like working with with files uh, or. Uh, um, moving uh, the data to Splunk and start like uh, exploration on your data and uh, uh, figuring out what, what you have and uh, what insights you can get from this data. And you have your first uh, uh, data analysts, uh, you know, just about data, data exploration is trying to figure out what to do um, and what, what you have actually. Uh, and then, as uh, we uh, as we grow, we hire. Uh, I mean, we, we we need to hire more uh, research firepower, and we use uh, ELK at the beginning. Um, it, it starting with uh, one instance, and uh, and later uh, we had like a huge uh, uh, cluster that we re in later in later phases we realized that it really cannot handle the amounts of uh, uh, data that uh, we had to uh, uh, to work on so uh, and then we moved to more uh, I would say modern platforms uh, uh, PySpark, uh, EMR, uh, SageMaker and, and this uh, area of solution um, also we're uh, heavily using uh, uh, AWS and uh, which is uh, also uh, adopting 
lots of technologies coming from uh, this area. So um, during this journey, we had to refactor and refactor and refactor. And we know that uh, uh, tomorrow, like if in, in a few years from now, we're, we're going to probably drop uh, PySpark and move to something else. It's not like it's something very realistic to uh, uh, like to expect it is going to happen. Um, and, and now, and also, um, we have uh, uh, we're improving and you know enhancing the team of the scientists that we are uh, uh, having here uh, in the team, uh, so we can get uh, better insights out of this data. Um, so today we're, we're handling uh, dozens or hundreds of terabytes of uh, uh, data uh, per day across the network. And um, yeah, yeah, I would say that it's really uh, cool. And uh, we, um, yeah, and it, it's, it keeps growing. So uh, I don't know uh, how to, uh, uh, to predict what's going to be uh, the next uh, <laughs> the next uh, step and technology that uh, we're going to use. Uh, and with that, um, I think that uh, I don't want to take all the time uh, for the introduction. Uh, so uh, just uh, want to, again, thank you all for, uh, um, for joining us. Uh, they, they told me to, to say that uh, we're hiring in Cato, but uh, <laughs> uh, no, but uh, but seriously, enjoy the rest of the evening. We have a great agenda. And uh, really, uh, thank you all in the PyData uh, community uh, that you join us. So uh, let's, uh, let's hand it over to uh, Avidan and Asaf for the next uh, session. Thank you.